Duke, lay down. Duke, lay down. Right there. I know. On the baseball booth, just pounding him and pounding him. Two dogs fight constantly. It's been an ongoing thing for three years. We always get them apart. You know, but, and then take it to that thing that, that pit bulls dog aggressive, very dog aggressive. And uh, she put him out in the backyard. And he I was. I just checked their day and it just let him out and left. So I put my dogs out. And that's we always check that the kids are home. And then they put the dog back out. How many dogs do you have? This is the puppy. We just got the puppy three weeks ago. Okay. Um, are you going to try to take the dog to the vet right now? No, no she's di he's dying. He there. was pounding him in the head. He's dying on me. He was pounding and pounding and pounding with a baseball bat. Okay, so I you're not going to try taking him to the vet? I guess we can. We can try, but I don't it. think he's going to make it. Man, he's just barely hanging on right now. It's going into the blood's going into his lungs right now. I can hear it. I mean, you can do whatever you want with the dog, but it's up to you. I mean, if I want him charged with abuse for beating him with a baseball bat. <laughs> okay, but the two dogs were fighting outside, correct? Yes. He, they, they, it was actually on, on their yard this time. Usually it's on our yard. But he, there was no reason for him to be doing that no with a baseball bat. They, they fight and we get them apart. It's not that he had to do that. This kid did not have to beat him with a baseball bat. He's in that house, house next door. He has a ran away.